Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Firecore Fantasy. Zzz. Uh, we're still playing Zelda. Always. Um, today we're actually going to talk about Zelda. Uh, this game particularly. This is, uh, I think as Carla mentioned before, this is her, this is her most favorite game. I'm a going. I'm a going. Ew, I don't feel so good. <laughs> um, so yeah, so Carla, this is your most favorite Zelda game. Why? <laughs> I wouldn't, I mean, I don't know if it's my most favorite. I did I say it was? Maybe I did. Um, I don't remember. I don't think you did. Dang or no, you grandma. no. You, well, you said you love Zelda. I I love Zelda. I've been playing Zelda since I was little, since before I could walk. The grandma, where's the shield? She got put it in the stew. <laughs> Look, I needed it. <laughs> I, I put the shield in it. It's gone now. Oh no. Aww. Is this what you're looking for? <gasps> Bitch! It's going in the fucking stew. Oh, well, she doesn't want me to leave. But she's smiling. Take it with you. Thank you. Oh, look at him. He's like discouraged. Yep. Look, her granddaughter just got taken by a bird. And now you're going off to save her. And you'll probably die. Me? Yeah. That's... Ha! <laughs> He's it's stuck in the... She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> the shield's been on your back this whole time. <laughs> Da, 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 da. So that actually is how it works. He just fucking like, makes that shit up. And he's like, he's not actually holding anything. Yeah. Dude, I'm gonna start doing that at work. <laughs> <laughs> like, caramel bottle. <laughs> like, <laughs> drag a pose. Like, what, are, what are you doing? He's like, oh, I'm sorry. Look, look, he's look like she's nervous. crying. She's shaking. Yep, she's like sobbing. She's got the shakes. The worst is later when you come back and she's like having nightmares. Like, Aww. that is the absolute worst part, I think, of this game. Oh. Hey guys, sorry about that. I had to cut the capture and restart. Um, some stuff happened. Um, but we are good to go. We're getting back to the episode. Yes. And we were talking about this game yes. and the shield. So yeah, so the, so the grandma gets like really sad. Yeah, she gets super depressed. I mean, both... Uh, your parents aren't alive. If you haven't like gotten, like gathered that. Well, they never are in Zelda games though, no. are they? Uh, no, there's like this whole backstory about how like... Link's mom had to drop him off at the Deku tree and stuff. Like, it, it's weird. It's complicated. But, well, uh, I mean, e every Zelda game, it's a different Link for most of them. Yeah, for the most part. Like, the the actual plot holes, or, like, the, the actual plot that's given is, like, if you die here, then this happens, or this timeline starts, or this is how... It's not, like, a linear plot. Well, the, there is actually... I'm pretty sure Nintendo released, like, a legit... Yeah, they released a serious timeline. And, and like, yeah. after Ocarina of Time, it splits into three set new timelines. Yeah, and there, there are points in time where it's, like... Because I know the very first game is um, Skyward Sword. Yes. It's the prequel that leads to Ocarina of Time. I believe this one is the last No, actually, one? I thought the Four Swords was the first game. Oh, it might be. I and, don't... Then, and then... Skyward Sword, or Skyward Sword, the Four Swords. I think Skyward Sword is the first one because it's in the sky, and then you develop the plot line into falling into Hyrule or the general grounded areas before okay. the birds, um, which is cool. There's your grandma watching you go. She's already dead. Just bye, grandma. Aww. Look at these waving. Aww. I just like bye, grandma. Bye, Grandma. How much longer are you going to take? Because, like, I'm done. Are you sure you shouldn't just quit right now? Seriously. I mean, look at her freaking prick smile. Like, do you not want me to be on this boat with you? Like, it's your fault my sister's taken. Like, they give you the option to just go back and leave her? Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes or no? Fade to black. Like, okay. that's it. <laughs> no, he's like, I'm fucking, I'm doing this. The angry eyebrows are real. Like, I'm set. I'm going to find my sister. I'm going to... Do this up. I'm gonna collect those tinkle bottles. I'm, I'm ready to go. Oh my god, the tinkle bottles are probably my favorite part of this entire game. <laughs> I know we said we weren't gonna do side quests, but we will be doing the tinkle bottles. You, you will be seeing them. Um, because they're in, hilarious. In far, as far as I'm concerned, it is the main part of this game. Actually, do we have the Wii U hooked up to Wi-Fi? I think we do. So we should we should be good. Ugh. Get out of the way, will you? <sighs> Turn around right now. Climb down. 
<laughs> Get out of here, punk. Bye. I have a telescope. I have a kaleidoscope. Kaleidoscope to telescope. you, telescope. dumb bitch. Uh. Look around. Mmm. Nice and tasty. <laughs> yeah, well. That's the floor. Yeah. Uh, do you want to know where you're supposed to go? Uh, well, I'm on a boat. Well, yeah, but you have to do some stuff. Oh, on the boat? Yes. Okay. Before I mean, you can get to the Forsaken Fortress. I mean, how, let's go. Come on. I mean, how big can the boat be? <laughs> go down through that door. Okay. Like, you just have to get one mini game out of the way, and it sucks. I hate it. it whoa! But... Apparently the boat's pretty big. Yeah, it's a big boat. Ah. What is it? Hey. Stop right there! This is Miss Tetra's cabin. Most of the real pirates aren't even allowed in here. There's no way we're letting an outsider in. Don't even think it. Jeez, dude. I don't freaking want to go in Texas room, bro. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Felicia. <laughs> That's like the one room on the boat. Really? Like she gets it. That's it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, have all you freaking hang around in this cargo space. <laughs> well, well. Hoy here, Swabby. As of today, <laughs> I, I, ahem, I am your superior, Nico. Now, I promise I'll go easy on you, so you do as I say. Okay? Looks like a, like a beaver. I know. Right. Now, first off, ha first off, you have to take off your, <laughs> you have to take the test. All new parts have to take. It's a bit of a doozy, so get ready. Take off your pants. <laughs> Take your pants off. So watch everything I'm about to show you real careful, like you can, like you can cram it into your no doubt mushy swabby brain. What a freaking little brat, dude. Yeah, he's awful. I, I couldn't like when I first got this game, I could not solve it, like do the thing. Really? Yeah, first it took me ages. Oh, like right now, yeah. or any of the, any of the puzzles? No, the, right. this one. This one sucks because it's very like it's not even a puzzle. <laughs> First off, you gotta press this switch. Then, this is the oh, oh, this is the only part. Just walk on it and tilt to step on it. Presto, switch pressed. <laughs> cool. I'm a little skull bell bug. Okay. All right now, check it out. After the platforms rise up to the floor, you gotta jump on them. <laughs> just like this. <laughs> okay. Alright, I get it. And I gotta swing from rope to rope. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's time. They're gonna go down, right? Yeah. Of course. Cool, cool. Let's... Um, he jumped really high. Yep. So we gotta, oh, I've gotta beat him? Well, you gotta make it over the other side. And uh -oh. he'll give you some stuff. <laughs> he'll give oh. you the stuff. He'll give me some shit. Some stuff. And if you don't, beat <laughs> game, if you don't beat this game, you can't get to the rest of the game. So, um. Okay, so do I have to take all those platforms, or can I do, take the route he just took? Because he just took like a shorter route. No, you have to go a specific way. I have to go on this side. Yep. What about the side he took? No, he went that way. It just didn't show him doing the entire thing. So you're gonna go. Yep. <laughs> Ooh, I see. Yeah. So you want to focus in on... Yeah. So, like, easy. I don't know what, what like what it was about this when I was playing on the GameCube, but like I, I couldn't um, do it. <laughs> yeah, bitch. That do it for you? Yeah. I fucking yeah, did it. You did it already? <laughs> Very good. I'm proud to have you as my, uh, as my underling. Shh. Got the stuff. I I wonder if it's okay. To, okay, to just give that to him. Who's he talking to? I don't see why. I don't see why not. I doubt I'll get busted. <laughs> All right, Swabby. I'll tell you what. You can have the treasure in, in my chest over here <laughs> in the back room. I'll reward you for the great and generous Nico. Thanks, dude. Hurry and take it before someone comes other than me. <laughs> what the fuck? Where's he going? He's just, just hanging. Just wants to watch you. Dude, I'm hanging too, Nico. What, what? Oh, I thought I could slice the. Whoa! No, you can't. Turn use your no, 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 no,
You got a spoils bag. You can put your spoils in here, like your rotten meat, your rotten, your rotten tomatoes. You got rotten, but you got banana peels. Toss them in the spoils bag. <laughs> like hello. <laughs> Give me the spoils. Yep. That's it. That's, uh, that's the spoils bag. Guess what, everyone? Find out next time on Firecore Fantasies just what the fuck we're gonna be doing with this spoil we're gonna, bag. We're gonna put a bunch of shit inside of it. We're not gonna tell you because we're not gonna spoil it for you. <laughs> oh! Bye. <laughs>